Again, I think that the biggest question, in, in, maybe in economics and politics of the coming decades, will be what to do with all these useless people. This afternoon, the Secretary General and Klaus Schwab, the founder of the World Economic Forum, will, sign a, will witness the signing of a memorandum of understanding on a strategic partnership between the UN and the World Economic Forum, which outlines areas of cooperation to deepen engagement between the two institutions and to jointly accelerate the implementation of the 2030 agenda. Going to a different economy, and we're going to be learning more about that uh, as we go, but clearly we're, we're, we're learning that things can be done uh, from remote, remote locations. We're learning that technology can replace people even more than we thought. We're not going back to the same economy. We're, going, we're recovering, but to a different economy, and it'll be one that is more leveraged to technology, and I worry that that is going to make it even more difficult than it was for, for many workers. In Silicon Valley and my friends who work in technology know that what we did to the manufacturing workers, we are now going to do to the retail workers, the call center workers, the fast food workers, the truck drivers, and then even bookkeepers, accountants, uh, insurance agents, lawyers, and on and on through the economy. So what happened to the manufacturing workers is a very clear sign. And so we'll import Chinese-based CBDC technology. So it's going to be CBDC in a box uh, provided to you by the People's Bank of China. Welcome, Welcome to, to the, the crypto, crypto teacher. teacher. And guys, please like and subscribe if you do like what you're listening to. Inform your friends and family and spread all over social media. It is imperative that we get back to learning finances and understand how the world really works. Because once we understand how the world really works, we understand that it is all planned out. Now, I want to thank those who purchased the books, Crypto Teacher and the New World Order Book. The New World Order Book is going to show you how the world really works. And it's definitely time for you to wake up out of that sleep, especially in the times that we're in right now. I told you at the beginning of the year, in the first quarter of 2022, we was going to have an event that was going to bring us down. And then also in the fourth quarter, we would have an event that would bring us down. That's exactly what happened. And now I'm going to tell you, in the first quarter, we're going to have an event that's going to break us down in 2023. And then also in the fourth quarter of 2023, we're going to have another main event. Now, of course, guys, the markets are still going to be pumping and dumping until they get ready to pull the full rug. But I'll let you know when that's about to happen. Now, also, I want to thank those who purchased the three kids books. It's time to get re-educated. And also, much love to those who've donated to the Cash Shop and Patreon. And in my Patreon, I keep you up to date with the New Road Order events. Also, I give you the New Road Order cryptos in the Patreon. Of course, you have to do your own research. But this next bull run is going to be a utility run. So you want to make sure that you have the cryptos that have utility. And much love to those who are shopping at both stores. Keep it coming. And of course, guys, we get into Bitcoin and cryptos first. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. And we have Bitcoin, cryptos, and stocks pulling back slightly. And even after the negative news about crypto and the media, Bitcoin and cryptos are staying steady. But we know that big dump is coming. Now, guys, do not forget we have options today. So don't forget to pay attention to the actual indicators. We have yield rates keep rising. And guys, we know when yield rates are rising right along with the dollar, is going to dump the market. And then, of course, guys, we have volume to the USDC, and then we have the Fed. Repo still over $2 trillion. We know they're raising rates and running off the balance sheet in order to destroy this legacy economy. So, then, therefore, the fourth industrial revolution can rise. And the NWO is pulling off plenty of magic tricks. So make sure you get focused. Do not get distracted. And we finally got the White House to make a response when it comes to Ohio. But we know that's another distraction that's going to lead to something bigger. Now, guys, we have Russia, CBDC, Pilot, and April. And guys, we know again, Russia, Ukraine is nothing but a distraction or to get us moved over to the fourth industrial revolution. Because we see Ukraine, Black Rock is in Ukraine to rebuild them for the digital transformation 
We know Russia has been planning for the digital transformation in 2014. And then also we have the Bank of Japan CBDC pilot to go up in May. And guys, we know that in the United States, we actually invited all the Japan leaders in order to plan out the fourth industrial revolution. That's the reason why the emerging markets are so far ahead of the United States. And all of this was done on purpose. Do not forget to watch my Society 5.0 videos. And then, of course, guys, we have Grayscale sitting at about $21.3 billion. Now, getting over into a little crypto news. We have eBay NFT platform Known Origin launches creator smart contracts and guys we know smart contracts are going to change everything that we do now we have theta network to enable collaborative machine learning with new partnership with ai platform fed ml now we have nft marketplace wearable expands aggregation to tezos and we know how important interoperability is now we have the SEC charges Terraform Labs and CEO Do Kwan with defrauding investors with crypto schemes, but no charges against the bank man. And we know Do Kwan is another one that they say is from South Korea, but he speaks perfect English. I think he spent time in Canada right along with CZ. And he went to Stanford University. And then once he left Stanford, he was a software engineer for both Microsoft and Apple. So we have the SEC waiting almost a year in order to take action on something they could have stopped before it even happened. Guys, remember you're watching nothing but a movie. And remember what I told you what the next movie would be. That's right, Binance. Now we have Binance move $400 million from Binance US back in 2021 with a company called Merit Peak. And we're starting to see the buildup of attacks to Binance. And we know, and we know, if Binance gets a liquidity shock, it's going to tank this market. And we know the NWO are the master magicians. This will give them the perfect reason in order to move the money in the back door. And remember the crypto teacher told you because he knows. When it comes to the New World Order, it's all planned out. But guys, all I have for you, don't forget about the books. It's crypto teacher and the New World Order book, plus the three kids' books. It's time to re-educate. Also, New to Cryptos, Coinbase, BitChute, Binance. Do not forget book links and crypto links are in the description. The stock channel, guys. Don't forget to go like, subscribe, spread everywhere. You have your Kobo, your chip size, your banking, your gaming. While everybody's sitting at home, get on stocks, the receiver, the biotech stocks. And while everybody's at home wishing. They were still getting that free money. What are they doing? Drinking and smoking weed. Don't forget about those stocks and you have a wonderful day. The most powerful person in the world is the storyteller. The storyteller sets the vision, values, and agenda of an entire generation to come. Steve Jobs. And guys, you know I truly believe in this. When you look at the New World Order, they're the storytellers. And that's the reason why I wrote my New World Order book. But guys, now it's time to change the current generation. And I wrote three kids books. You know, I love the Trinity because I understand the power that's in it. So I have three books. We have an opportunity to change the generation, to educate, not just me, but I want to show you that I take action on a daily basis. And I want you to take action on a daily basis, whether it's your job, whether it's in your community. We have an opportunity right now to educate the masses. I posted this on my Twitter account. Please share, but this is a short clip of the three books. There's going to be a clothing line and action figure. Please get these books for your kids, nephews, cousins, friends. So therefore, we can start the re-education now. Because as we see, the fourth industrial revolution foundation is definitely here. Robots, algorithms, drones, taking humanity out the picture. We have to re-educate, but let's get into the video. Part one, King Yahshua and Drama Team. Save the village. Part two, King Yahshua and Drama Team. Save New York. Oh, COVID-33. Part three, King Yahshua and Drama Team. Goes to China. It's mandatory 
to get part one, part two, and part three of this series. It's time to re-educate Generation Z.